Hello everybody, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing a squishy bunny preview for the two slimes in that. And yeah, let's just get right into the video. Um, sorry if I sound sick. I am actually really sick when I'm filming this. But I wanted to film it anyways. And then of course it's forever, which I'm so sorry about. Wow. Everything came back nice and securely and tight. Nothing broke or cracked during shipping. And shipping time was about three days, which is honestly really good. For extras, they included a business card with some wax which is pre-made I would definitely recommend to label it because it did not come labeled and it also came with a mochi squishy. Here I show that it's not labeled. I ordered birthday foam and sasha buns so starting off with birthday foam this one came Nicely wrapped. I was struggling to get it open. Um, and this is a Michael Flom bead slime, white glue bead. Um, and it smells like birthday cake, and it smells so good. I need to know what this scent is from because it's oh my goodness, I, I almost want to eat this, but don't eat slime. Um, it came a little bit deactivated, which is totally fine um doing this hot seven months i totally understand um and it comes with these multi-colored beads which gives it an extra little bit of oomph crunch i guess you'd say enjoy this i guess i'll quit talking here. Moving on to the next slime, we have Fresh Buns, which is a DIY clay slime. This is inspired there by the little dog, which is a corgi, and her name is Buns. Um, so cute. I'm obsessed with this slime. The base is a slice slime. I definitely, definitely recommend playing with this base before mixing the clay in. It's so nice. I'm obsessed with the texture. They should just sell the base by itself. But anyway, that's this one. This is a tan slime, and it's scented like fresh baguette and baked bread, which is kind of the same thing. But it smells amazing. Um, and when you mix the clay in, it will become a butter slime, and it is so inflating. I will insert a picture of the inflation at the end of these clips. The clay piece is so, so detailed. It's crazy. I don't know how they got it like to be like this. But it is also a 
brownish color and i think they use daiso because it's so soft and i didn't want to mix this up but i have to do it for you guys um but yeah i don't know what else to say about this thing it's overall amazing That concludes the end of this review on their shop. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. And turn on the post notification so you get notified every time I post a brand new video. Bye guys.